Good morning, my sweet birdies. I wanted to read you a book on Passover since that is the holiday that is right around the corner. So let's read this book. It was one of Sophia's favorite books and I wrote it all the time to her. When buds burst open and birds appear, so do our relatives. Passover's here. Our house looks Passover perfect. Even grandma says so. Everything is sparkly, clean, even Wiggly Mo. That's the little boy. Hooray! At the Passover table, Mo gets excited. He asks if our new puppy Izzy's invited. At Passover, Papa says, no one is turned away. If Izzy minds his manners, he too can stay. In the kitchen, Mama warms our favorite dish, matzo ball soup, yummy. Delish. Papa fixes gefilte fish. Sam adds a special bone to the Seder plate. Everyone is busy. Mo jumps up to sneak a peek. Careful, so does Izzy. That bone is not your own, Izzy. Sundown, time for our Seder to begin. We hurry to the table, we squeeze and settle in. Mo sits in our lap to be sure he can see. Together we read the story of how now we are free. While we sip and dip and eat platefuls of cooking, Grandpa hides the matzah where, when he's sure we're not looking. Whoever has the sharpest eyes finds the matzah and gets a prize. Is it here? Is it there? Behind the curtain? Under the chair? We hunt high, we hunt low. Where's the matzah? Does anyone know? Mimi me knows, cries Mo. He points at Izzy's teeth and gums. What's left of the matzah? Only crumbs. So can you guess who wins the prize? Mo, the littlest of the guys. Surprise! Izzy is a matzah pup. He loves to eat that matzah up. Time to sing songs and eat, even, and eat even more while we watch for Elijah and open the door. We're full now and fat. We feel cozy and warm. We reach for each other for a huge family hug. We're ready for bed. What a long special day. We can dream now of Passover. <gasps> oh, woof! I hope you enjoyed that. Bye birdies, I'll see you later. Love you, I miss you guys so much.